Hey guys, it's Jeff with Game Zombie. I'm here with Adam, executive producer of World Gone Sour. Now, what can you tell me about the game? Uh, World Gone Sour is an irreverent platformer. Uh, we try to make something that's really fun and engaging. Uh, basically, you play as an inch high uh, Sour Patch Kid candy, and you jump through this crazy world that happens in movie theaters, kids' rooms, and all over the place. Uh, and basically, the goal is to get in the belly of a human, like any candy would want to. Um, and along the way, you save a bunch of other Sour Patch Kids. Now, the interesting thing is you don't only have to save them, you also have to sacrifice them to maximize your score. Did you sacrifice innocent lives to get here? Well then, welcome to the party! So there's a lot of really unique elements of the game. I mean, you see the, the fake brand names, those are funny. And then Creed Bratton, well known for The Office, is yeah. doing the narrative. Yeah. And what's that kind of like, working with something so unique? Uh, well, I mean, it was crazy. Yeah, when you think about Method Man and then Candy and then video games and then Creed Brand, it's kind of a strange combination. Uh, but that's really what we wanted to go for. Uh, Creed Brand was a fantastic partner. I mean, we wrote the script only after we cast him, and then he came into the recording studio and did an amazing job of improving. There's even a, a, a rap that he did when you finish the game, which is incredible. It blew me away. Um, he was amazing to work with, but the great thing about Creed is that he sort of reflects the brand, too. He's kind of like the Candy, like, sour and sweet, like kind of you're like, you're like, oh, there's an unassuming older guy, and then he says something crazy, you're like, what? So he basically yeah, plays his character from the office in our game, which was a lot of fun to work with him. Yeah, so the game itself, it looks like you might assume that, hey, it's Sour Patch Kids, that's for kids, but it's obviously not a kids game, is not it? At <laughs> not at all. Yeah, one of the big things we want to do is make sure that it's sort of for gamers by gamers. The development team in Ottawa, their name is Playbrains, and they're a bunch of hardcore gamers. So we want to make sure we're making something that would be fun for uh, for the core audience, which is really the, the sort of teen it up and stuff like that. So um, there's definitely a lot of racy stuff that he does in the game and says in the game, and a lot of crazy brands. And especially when you get to the final level, the shed level, there's buzz saws everywhere, ripping and tearing Sour Patch Kids apart, melting them and setting them on fire. It's you know, pretty crazy. That's that's a little bit, I don't know. I don't know if I'm okay with that. I love Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, and killing candy, right? I mean, you do that by eating it anyway. <laughs> Depending if you eat the head first or the tail first. Yeah. All right, so when can we look forward to getting our hands on this? Uh, Wednesday, April 11th, it's going to be out on PSN and XBLA for five bucks. Local co-op, so you can play with your friend on the couch beside you. And uh, yeah, I think people have a lot of fun with it. All right, you heard the man. Pick up the game. It's fun. It's funny. And it's cheap, and it's coming out soon. What's what's to go wrong? Yes.